Hi everyone, this is Ben coming to you from the practice range with your tip of the week. In this week's tip, we're going to cover how to maintain grass on our range tee. Now this year we've been doing a lot better job of using our surface as well and making sure that we always have good grass to hit off of. We've been doing that by rotating to our mats more frequently, but also through better practices of hitting in strips on the range. And we're going to cover that today. What exactly is hitting in strips? As you can see, there are many different sizes, shapes, and patterns for divots on our range tee. But in every case, those patterns that are in straight lines allow you to hit more golf shots in a smaller area, saving turf and making regrowth without seeding much easier. So do us all a favor and hit your shots in straight lines. We don't want to have to sick our intimidating bagroom staff after you. Here's a good example of poor technique. We often see people make the mistake of taking divots in too wide an area by moving too fast. We call this the old rake and hit technique. It leads to bad shots and a lot of turf being taken. You can see the area of turf this actually covers is quite large. Next time you're in the range, take your time between shots. Pull each ball over from the crate, place it behind your previous divot, line yourself up, and hit your shot. This will lead to better timing, better divot patterns, and ultimately, better shots. Here you can see, I hit the same amount of shots, but in a much smaller area, and they were all better swings. So a trick to help you create strips on the range is to use the alignment stakes that are located at every stall these blue stakes are designed to help you line up to the target, but are also helpful when we're trying to create divots that go directly at our intended target. If we do that, we're much more inclined to hit a ball straight, as well as take care of the turf here on the range. So I've got a stall set up right here with an alignment stick heading right out towards the blue flag on the third green. I've already hit a shot or so, and I'm going to line another ball up directly behind my previous divot. And I'm gonna go ahead and hit a shot directly towards that blue flag and try to make my next divot go through the first one right at that flag. So we'll set it up just like this. Set up to hit the shot, check our target and make a swing. So I hope this trick helps you with your alignment on the range as well as help us take care of our turf. Play well.